Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel and to another study with me. This is a weekend study with me, so it's what I did on Friday afternoon and on Saturday. And I started out by making my study plan using this study planner from Pumpkin Productivity, which is Ruby Granger's company. Ruby is such a lovely person and I am also such a big fan of her YouTube channel and she was so kind to send me one of her study planners. I just find that having a proper study plan makes everything a lot easier. So if you'd like to check out Pumpkin Productivity, I have left the link in the description box. At the moment, I'm going through types of inorganic reactions in chemistry. So here I was just finishing up some problems on precipitation reactions. But then, as I had finished everything I wanted to do for math this week, I just wanted to do a couple of extra problems on the chapter that I started this week, which was differential equations. And now I'm gonna be honest with you, I didn't do more studying on Friday, but now it's Saturday and I am back doing some biology and I am taking notes on the topic stem cells and stem cell therapy. I think I've mentioned this in a previous video, but I prefer doing lighter and more fun types of studying on the weekends. So that is why you'll see me doing a lot of note taking because it is something that I actually enjoy doing and it's also not that hard either. Also these clips of me taking notes on stem cell therapy are slightly out of focus and I am sorry about that.
And now we're back in focus, so here I'm just taking out the notes that I've just written and hole punching them. And then I'm also writing summaries at the bottom of the pages of notes that I've previously taken. I just find that it is a very good way of reviewing what I've written. And the summaries are also really useful to have when revising your notes later. Then I felt like I needed a break from biology, so I went back to chemistry and types of reactions. And here I just took notes on neutralization reactions. I went through some examples and also did a couple of practice problems. And then I also went through the last topic, which was redox reactions, just so that I'm ready to start on the practice problems next week. And then for the last part of my weekend study session, I went back to biology. So I went over the notes that I had previously made summaries of. So I typed up some flashcards in Quizlet that I could use for revision later. So that is it for this weekend study with me. I really hope that you enjoyed it and that it maybe gave you some motivation. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next week with another video.